Hey everyone, this is the Blue Sniper Force Snap Snap 95, and we're me, Warlord, and Gamer are talking about uh, Mike Nelson TV. Warlord, go go right ahead. I pulled a big picture where it didn't happen on him, and he tried pulling, getting pictures, but I'm still not convinced. Well, we'll just get to that in a minute. Alright. Uh, yeah, we're just going uh, to talk about what he does. We're, we're not going to uh, talk about how fake it is or what we are, but uh, that's not how we're going to do it. Uh, we're just going to do something in mental commentary. Yes, we're, we're not going to like, uh, prove it wrong or anything like that, but we are going to do it anyway, but that's not the main subject, I guess I would say. Yeah, and it was um, all terminating stuff. I think uh, Ghost got him off. Yeah, uh, I think it was between uh, Dan and Ghost, or I'll just say Gamer and Ghost. About yeah, because... Uh, uh, it was really Dan and uh, Ghost. It was really Gamer and Ghost who were really trying to uh, attack uh, not attack, but uh, fake Ghost and Gamer and Ghost to Yeah, back back for uh, the the Sor Flex and Midi is fake, and well, we all know what what's going on now, from. It's all that silly junk. Mainly because trying to keep YouTube a decent place. I doubt he would. I doubt he would if he even knew. Basically, yeah, promoting terrorism. He was all surprised and crap, and he was like, oh, how do you know he's fake? And I was like, he admitted it and stuff. Four videos, four videos. First one was basically like, hey, I'm Mike Dills and I'm back and stuff. Second one, uh, he was like, hey, I'm showing off to my weapons and crap. I'm totally going to take over the world. Third one, he was like, how I'm going to take over this country in the Caribbean and stuff. And then, uh, then he, uh, said, 
he showed us some alleged pictures, which I believe they're all crap, because I said, hey, picture didn't happen. And I, I pulled off that big loophole on him. Yeah, he only showed a 22. What, whoop de do. I don't believe crap he says. He can't prove any legitimate evidence without having it say, Oh, you're just not, you just don't listen, and you're just, just shut up. Yeah, uh, see, this fourth video, which was about, uh, yeah, that's really not much. One was a, uh, one was a nuclear warhead, well, looked like some, in my opinion, it looked like something from M MS Paint. And here's the thing, before you go on. Uh, he didn't even know the name of each uh, nuclear weapon. I don't know of it either, but he didn't know the name to it. So if you were trying to be official, you would know the name to what weapon he was thinking of. But I didn't go and continue. Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Do you have anything else? Uh, not really. I'm just saying, I'm still waiting for, I'm still waiting for his proof, and I haven't gotten it yet. I mean, I could, it, look, it looks too pixely to be a real thing, in my opinion. We, well, we didn't get a full picture of it. We, didn't, I, we saw it, but we don't... We just got a short glimpse of it. Yeah, yeah, uh, I, remember, I got that message, too. He's like, don't share this information with anyone. And then he's like, and then he's like Mike Nelson's real. He captured me and stuff. I honestly don't believe any of this stuff. And he had some earbuds on. And the video, and the video is partially privatized. Not also to mention that. Yeah, I mean, tell tell the National Guard or something. Sounds a lot similar, and 
We're running out of time. This is the Blue Sniper 4795. This is uh, the other guy's Warlord. See you all later.